in the rewrite tonight, once again, the end of the world. You may have seen billboards and subway ads like this one. This picture was taken by the last words Nick Ramsey on his commute to work today on the R train. It says that the end of the world is coming on May 21st. Yes, that's May 21st, 2011. Yes, that's next Saturday. Are you listening now? Yeah, the end of the world is coming next Saturday. You can read all about it in a book called The Doomsday Code which the poster says is available at Barnes & Noble, or you can download it, as we did today, free at websites run by this man, 89-year-old radio host Harold Camping, who says his Bible study has led him to make a series of calculations that have determined with exactitude that the world is coming to an end next Saturday at about 6 p.m. Pacific time. An NPR report that brought Harold Camping to our attention points out that he's been wrong about this kind of thing before. He actually predicted in a book entitled 1994, question mark, that the world would end in 1994. When it didn't, instead of moving on to something easier like predicting the weather or outcomes of elections like I do, he went back to recalculating when the end of the world would come. Mr. Camping says he found the clues to our real expiration date in the book of Jeremiah, a book of the Bible he had for some reason neglected to study when he made his erroneous 1994 prediction. This would all be laughably ignorable if no one was taking Mr. Camping seriously, but people are taking him seriously. Too many people are actually taking him seriously. NPR found a New Jersey accountant who says he stopped thinking about his 401k because he knows the world is going to end on, March, on May 21st. And a pregnant woman with a two-year-old daughter whose second child is due in June after the end of the world, who with her husband is spending the last of her savings, every dollar, so that they will be absolutely penniless on May 21st, when Harold Camping has convinced them that the world is going to end. I have had to tell Glenn Beck's audience that the world is not going to end. And now it falls to me to tell Harold Camping's audience that the world is not going to end. Specifically, it is not going to end on May 21st. Any plans you have made for the world to end on May 21st are a mistake, a terrible mistake. You should go back to putting money in your 401ks. And when the world doesn't end on May 21st and you realize Harold Camping is a complete fraud and you feel confused and adrift in the world and don't know where to look for guidance, just know that on May 23rd at 8 p.m., the man who told you the truth about the end of the world will be once again sitting in this chair telling you more truth. And from that day forth, having renounced the teachings of Harold Camping, you will always have this program to come to to help you see the light.